Oh my gosh, it's so good to see you face to face. I have not been on the camera doing the vlogs in a while, so I thought I would throw an extra vlog your way because today is really fun. I am going to go to our local Facebook group's monthly meetup. So the Facebook group is called the Oregon Planner Society. So if you are local or if you're in town, feel free to join the group and we would love to see you at a meetup. So I'm going to share kind of my journey today. It's going to look a little bit like my shopping vlogs, but also kind of different. I might even do a little bit of shopping during this because it's actually being hosted at the classroom space in one of my favorite Joann's. Although I don't really know what's up with Joann's right now. Like they declared bankruptcy and then they were closing stores. But now this one is like, I don't know. Like they have this big, beautiful store with this big, beautiful classroom space. But we are having our meetup there today nonetheless. So July meetup for Oregon Planner Society. If you guys like these type of things, I will keep doing them because we do meet monthly if it's okay with my group, of course. But I can't wait to see you guys there. So let's head down the road. I'm actually hosting this one. So we kind of like take turns, like picking a location and hosting and that kind of thing. So I'm hosting this one. So I'm really excited about it. So I thought that's why I would share it with you all. So let's just go ahead and check it out. Hide and seek till I found you. guys I just got here I am going to go check in soon I called yesterday to confirm and it seems like the store has a like a lot going on they have a lot of freight coming in and that freight may have been in the area that they were planning to use for us but they did say that they would find a spot for us to be so we are still gonna have our meet up here I will go in in a few minutes and I will check in I'm so excited to see everybody and yeah I can't wait to see everybody for the meetup today. Okay, I just got here and this is our table. So we're in the like creator studio in the like free space at Joanne's. And if you're ever looking to like host a meetup, you can do something similar too. But nobody is here yet, but I'm really excited to see everybody. So update you more later. was here I would just do a little shopping since this meetup is at Joann's so now let's see oh these EC stickers are kind of cute yeah these are cute I really don't feel like I need to buy a ton though because I get kits so much now but these are cute I feel like this is like the same amount of stuff though that they had the last time <laughs> those are kind of cute and then these sticky notes I actually have at home. I think I got these at Go Wild. Oh, threw it on the ground. Here we go. Pick it up. And then these are kind of cool. I actually kind of like these. Hmm, but not for $8.49. It's a little crazy. And then of course we have like the planners. There's a couple things. And then as far as Happy Planner goes, they have some of the Work Plus Life down here they have oh this is kind of a cute cover i think i've seen this before oh cooking 101 that's actually adorable recipe organizer i love that okay and then stickers flowers and feather oh those are actually kind of cute with the bees i don't think i've seen this one before this i got the planner to go with this it's cute what else seeds of joy wait a second I think 
Oh no, I thought those stickers were missing. It's kind of crazy. Cute, there's so many cute things. Okay, and then I don't see any like any of the teacher release here though. That's kind of odd. Although the lady did say they have a ton of inventory they need to get through and they just have not been able to. So I'm sure that is part of the reason. They've got planners and covers and stencils. These are kind of cool stencil bookmarks. These are neat. Okay, well, I will pop back into the car and I'll tell you guys all about how the meetup went since you just had some B-roll footage of it. Hey guys, so I know I didn't do like a ton of filming, but there wasn't actually that many people who showed up, but I was really happy to see the people who did show up. They are some people I've seen at other meetups before, which is kind of fun. So that was really fun. And we basically just like sat around and like did our planners. I did my EC planner because my plan with me for, t well, this week tomorrow tomorrow your time I don't know when this vlog is gonna go live but the plan with me that I'm putting up on Sunday is actually going to be you know the happy planner one so I didn't start that planner in July but I am gonna do one for this week because I do want to get back into like my creative journaling and have a journal that's active so you guys are actually like inspiring me to start that but back to the meetup we like sat around and talked it was so fun but, okay, so funny story. When we first got there, I had called ahead. Actually, like, it started back in May. I called ahead and I asked, you know, if we could use the space to see if it was even available so that I could, like, plan a meetup. And they said that it was, but that they had a bunch of freight that they needed to move and all of this. So I was like, okay, cool. I'll email you the dates of the meetup and you can, like, let me know if that's going to work or if you can, like, move the freight by then. And... I called yesterday and I'm actually really glad that I did because I think that they must just be like vastly understaffed or just like super busy or something is going on because that same freight from like two months ago is still just like hanging out in their store and I don't know if it's like processes from this like bankruptcy that's going on because I know that other stores are closing in other areas. It's kind of like a crazy mess for Joann's right now but we did get to use a space that was their classroom space. So Joann's actually used to like have classes, like crafty type classes here and that kind of thing. But I haven't seen one of those happen in quite a while, but they did let us use their space. And there was literal boxes like around us. It looked like the store was like closing down or something. It was kind of wild, but I was very, very thankful because the manager was so nice to us and she, you know, was trying to figure out how she could still make it work for us and that kind of thing. And she was like, well, I could put you over here or like you guys could go in the kids area. And I was like, you know, we're totally fine. We're gonna be a small group, no more than probably 15. It ended up being just four of us, which is, absolutely fine even though I think like 10 people are SVP'd but that's <laughs> that's another story so there was just four of us and but they were actually able to like clear off one of the tables even though it was like surrounded by boxes like it was a nice table it was a nice space so we all kind of got to sit together I worked in my planner and like chit chatted we talked about like old school planner stuff that had happened back in the day we you know we just like had a really good time and it was just a lot of fun and if you have a local planner group in your area I definitely recommend like checking them out because honestly there is nothing like sitting down even just once a month with people who like get your hobby and who are excited about your hobby and who like also do your hobby and like getting to chit chat with them, seeing what everybody uses, seeing all the different things because there was, okay, so there was me, I was planning in my EC planner and then there was another girl who I think had previously used like the Hobonichi or like the... Oh my gosh, I don't even remember the name of that paper that they have in there, but a different planner that has that like Hobonichi style paper and then two other girls who use the Happy Planner. So we all kind of use different things and it was just a lot of fun and we got to chit chat. You know, we had space to sit together. I don't know. It was just a lot of fun and you know, it was just, it was really good. And then of course we like take a group photo at the end and you know, it was really just a good time to connect with everybody. So highly recommend if you have a group, checking them out and like going to any meetups that they have 
or if you don't have a group in your area, I would consider even like starting one if you feel brave enough to do that and just see if there's any other like paper people in your area. Ours is actually like a statewide group. So it's the Oregon Planner Society. So even look like in a broader area, most of us are like pretty centrally located in the Portland area, but we do have people who travel occasionally. I don't think I've seen any meetups planned in other areas, but those of us in the Portland area are pretty active. But yeah, if you can, I would definitely recommend checking something like that out because this group of people is very special to me and I'm very glad that I got to share even just a little bit of it with you. It was mostly like me talking to you about it, but I hope to get more footage at upcoming meetups. And if you would like to see something like that, let me know if you'd like me to film more of it next time or if you would like to see this style of video again. So let me know if you would like to see it. So thanks so much for being here. I appreciate all of you. You are the best. And yeah, so thanks so much for being here. If you're new here, hi, my name is Caitlin. I would love it if you would hit that red subscribe button down below and follow along. If you are one of my current followers, thank you so much for all of your love and support. And if you'd like to find me anywhere else, you can check out all of the links down in the description box below. I am mostly active on Instagram at creating in chaos underscore official. I need to get back there though, I know. And then you can also check out any coupon codes or affiliate links that I have down in the description box below as well if you are doing any planner shopping today. So thank you so much for being here. And by the way, you guys have fun today.